Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I'm just going to do a memory plan with me and I'm gonna do it with the Gold Paper Prints Fall Foliage Kit. And um, if you didn't see my haul when I displayed this kit, I'll just show it real quick. Here's the half boxes, quarter boxes, habit trackers, three heart checklists. And then we have your date covers, your date dots, some scripts, some icons, the weekend banner, and some headers. Here we're gonna have your glitter headers and the bottom washi. And then here we're gonna have some headers, um, some blank headers, or blank headers right here. You have your blank headers, then you have your littles, and you have some build-do stickers. And then here you have your full heart checklist and some Monday through Sunday um, weekly boxes. These are, well, one of them for sure I'll use for the sidebar. Um, but if you want to see how I decorate this, just keep on watching. All right, so we're just going to start with the full boxes. Actually, I'm going to start with the glitter headers. and bottom washi lay down now I'm going to do the headers and then I'm going to put down my work labels on each day that I work and then we'll go back in and do the full boxes
the full boxes down and I have uh, the full box over in the sidebar. So now I'm just gonna put down my work headers and then I'll do my sidebar and then go through each day filling it out. set to move on to each day and fill in what I did so if you want to see how I fill out each day keep on watching first thing in this memory spread I'm going to start with is the sidebar I'm just going to write everything in here so um, my weekly habits are water that I hit my water goal and Bible. Um, right now, me and a couple of extended family members are um, doing a Bible a Bible chapter a day. So we do that, and uh, we're in a group me, and we share what we learned from that scripture, or we'll just share a picture um, of the verse that stood out to us. So um, I do just. Um, and this started October 1st or September 1st. Yeah, this started September 1st. So we've been doing this almost two months now. Wow. So um, when you do something, you get in the habit of doing it. You don't even realize how long you've been doing it. So that's why I say wow. But um, I like to keep record of that. And then I also... Um, I struggle, struggle, struggle with getting my daily water in, so I keep a note of that. And as you'll see when I fill this out, I hit the goal like two days. Um, so I am trying, and I'm not going to give up. But, um, yeah, that's what's going on here with the habits. And then I didn't put a header on this, but this, this box, Monday through Sunday, is for... My daily steps I do not hit 10,000 steps a day I don't even hit close to it um, but I do still like to keep a record of the steps that I took so on Monday I took 2,870 steps 1.4 miles Tuesday was 2,957 also 1.4 miles Wednesday was 2517, 1.2. Thursday was a really good day, 10,955. We have 5.1 miles. Friday, 1251, 0.6. Saturday was 23.63 for 1.1. And then Sunday was 2.976 for 1.4. Um, and then the next week after um, this week that I am memory planning for was my brother's birthday. So next week... I'll put Mo's birthday. I paid off some debt. And I got some budget happy mail. All right, and then that's just, oh, let me fill these out. So I did hit the goal Monday. I hit the goal Wednesday and I hit the goal Sunday. So I actually hit the goal three days that week. 
Um, and then on the Bible, I do do that. I did do that every day. All right. Now on Monday, my schedule was 7.30. To four Tuesday seven thirty to four and then Wednesday was seven thirty to twelve Thursday I worked seven AM um to 3.30, I believe. I did work until 3.30, but I worked another shift, so I'm just gonna put another work label here, actually. I'm gonna do a brown one. Three thirty, and then my second job I worked four p.m. to four thirty a.m. the next morning, and then Friday I worked from eight to four thirty p.m. All right, and so Monday. The 28th, um, I woke up early like I always do, so I don't normally note when I wake up just because I normally wake up early every single day. Um, got ready for the first day of my second job. So I'll put that in right here. And that was a really good feeling. I was super excited. Um, you know, I was ready to make a little extra cash at another job. I was happy with the place. Um, not so much I was happy with the place because I had never worked there, but I was proud to have gotten on at that place. Um, I'm not gonna share where it was. Um, if you know, you know, and if you don't, sorry. But um, I was excited. I was excited to start there. And it deserves its own sticker, period. So next, uh, of course, I worked all day. Like I said, I got off at 4 that day. Um, I just really, while I'm at work, I, I don't really do anything. So I don't have anything to put there. But... Um, during my breaks and my lunch, I did play one of my favorite games on my phone, uh, which is Cooking Craze. And I mean, that's legitimately one of my favorite games. I play that, and if I'm playing on the game, that's on my phone. If I'm playing on the game system, I'm playing Call of Duty. Those are the only two games I play. Um... It is not like a daily thing for me. I normally really don't even like playing games, but if I'm playing a game, you're gonna find me playing one of those. All right, so once I was off of work, I did do my daily YouTube binge. I watch either playing with me's or I watch budget videos. Those are my absolute favorite. Um, so that's, that's just what I did. I'm either watching YouTube or I'm watching something on Netflix with Nick um, at this time because uh, right now when I'm recording this it's October 29th so about a month ago but um, during this time we were watching The Flash every day almost and um, we're actually done with it now a little sad about that but um, I mean that's that's what we did. We would watch The Flash. We would chill. And if I wasn't watching The Flash, I was watching Netflix. So on the 28th. Oh. Can't forget. I did my laundry. 
Uh, let me put this down. We did have wings for dinner. So I'll put this towards the bottom here. And I actually learned this little trick from one of my buddies, Chelsea. Um, I will put the link to her channel down in my description box below if you're interested in going over and showing her some love. Um, she does playing with me videos. She does a base video. Uh, then she'll do a video, I believe, of her uh, filling everything out. So more like a memory plan. Um, she does a lot of planner videos and I s enjoy her channel tremendously. Um, so if you're interested, be sure to head on over there. Like I said, I'll put the link in the description. But I did learn this little trick of using two little washies. Um, you can use that as, you can make it into like a half box. These are a little crooked, but it'll be okay. And I'm just going to put laundry on there because I did do laundry on this day. All right, and that's what I did on Monday. So moving on to Tuesday, woke up early, 6.30, um, went to my second job as usual. Um, let's see, what else did I do that day? Um, I did take a homemade lunch on uh, Tuesday because on Monday I didn't take any lunch, so I did have to go out to eat for lunch because I had taken my debit card and I'm so used to, um, I'm so used to ATMs, not ATMs, I'm so used to vending machines having the credit card swiper on it, but in the building that I was in, they did not have the credit card swiper, so I didn't have anything to eat that day, so I did just walk right down the street and get something to eat, but on Tuesday, I decided I was going to bring my own lunch, which I did, it was amazing. Um, and I was able to save $13 because I spent $13 on my day and I absolutely didn't want to spend that again. So, um, went to work, ate lunch, came home. And then this was pretty much, um, Uh, it was pretty much a game night. Like, came home, chilled, played Call of Duty, played some cooking craze. Um, but that was literally pretty much it. I just, I just relaxed. Because when I get home, and even when I sit at home and I work all day, like, on the computer, I just get mentally drained and I just want to chill and scroll and you know, do what I want to do with my time. So that is what I did. Played me some games. I'm trying to, I'm just looking at my list here to see what else I did that day. Um, and I really don't have much else listed. Um, Some good old Let's see some good old planning. And again, like I said on this day I had to take my own lunch, so I decided when I came home to do a little meal planning. And then I also paid my car payment on this day. Or 
right there. Oh, that all was in focus. If not, let me readjust my camera a little bit. If that wasn't in frame, I do apologize. And last thing I'm going to put down is that we did binge watch on The Flash and I was also asleep by midnight. And y'all, I mean, when we were binging on The Flash, like we were watching so many episodes in one day. I mean, we probably went through that um, gosh, we probably went through that series in like two months, six seasons in two months, but I really did like the show, and we had watched some of The Flash before, honestly, I didn't really remember much of it, I think we probably watched a couple of episodes of the first season, and then we moved on like we were what well, I personally was into um, watching Grey's Anatomy and how to get away with murder and things like that. So I wasn't really into the flash and I had never really been into superhero shows, um, cartoons, comic books, any of that. So, I mean, it was a good show, but I just wasn't really into it. So. I just um, had put it, you know, just put it in the back of my mind to watch. It wasn't something I was interested in. So this is everything that happened on Tuesday. And now I'm going to work over on Wednesday. Wednesday, I did half a day. Um, I just went pretty much. We had one more um, thing that they wanted to tell us or show us. And then... That was it. My husband came and picked me up. Um, I, I did ask him. He was actually off during that week. Um, so I just asked him to take me and pick me up because it just it made sense for the simple fact that it would, the where I was going was downtown and I didn't want to have to pay to park. And he was off work and we lived two minutes from where I was. So he um, picked me up and we went to the arena pub and grill and like i told you all on monday i had to actually buy something to eat and this is where i went and i told nick we should try it so we decided to go there and honestly the rest of the day i just chilled and relaxed um this is wednesday uh, so i did do my budgeting video I did post that. So I did film and edit. Or no, I, I edited and uploaded it because I had already done the video. So I went and I edited. Post it my weekly budget video. And that was really about it for Wednesday. So um I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next day and I'll come back and figure out what I'm gonna put right there. So for Thursday, um, again, I worked from 7 to 3.30 at my first job, 4 p.m. to 4.30 a.m. second job. Um, and that was kind of just like strike one, two, and three for me at that second job because I was told I wouldn't work more than 12 hours the entire day, including my lunch. Uh, they worked me 12 and a half. And then um, they were also disorganized. They didn't know when they wanted me to come in the next day. Um, they 
didn't have my schedule prepared when I came. I almost feel like they didn't even know that I was coming the day that I came. So they were kind of just going off the off the off the cuff or whatever. Um I have a very good first job. It pays the bills, it it helps me save money. Um I, I'm I'm doing very well with my first job and with my husband's job as far as our incomes combined. So um I didn't necessarily need the second job, but I did want to make some extra money um, for extra savings. The holidays are coming up, things like that. Um, but it just didn't. I am. I'm. I'm all about structure and being sure that you know um, what you've hired me to do. And they just they in the specific part of the company that I work, they just weren't organized. I'm not gonna say the whole company is like that. My mom worked at this company for years and um, she retired from there. It just wasn't the place for me. So um, this was the first and last day that I actually worked um, at this job. Um, now I did um, go to orientation the first three days, but this was the day I actually went and worked at this job again for 12 and a half hours. So not only did I work eight at my first job, but I worked 12 and a half at my second job. And that's not the second job's fault that I decided to have two jobs. But if you tell me I'm gonna work 12 hours, then I should be off in 12 hours. And then they also had told me that I wouldn't be going in until 6 p.m. So with the time they wanted me to come in, it was interfering with my first job. And um, I just wasn't ready to give up my first job. So <laughs> anyways, that's just, um, a little tangent there but uh oh so let me go back over and actually move some of these stickers down um because i do have a sticker here that actually says last day of second jobs orientation so i'm gonna make sure i put this in there and then me and Nick didn't realize these were the same color stickers, but that's okay. Me and Nick went to the restaurant. And I went home and edited my video, got that posted. There we go. Uh, I'm actually thinking about getting some full box underlays just so like all this white space will have like some type of design in it. I just think it'll make it pop even more than it already does. So on Thursday, worked all day. Um... That's about it. I worked all day. And you know what? When I came home, my husband was actually awake and waiting on me. So, that felt really good. And then I had to go to sleep as soon as I came home because I had to be up and like, two hours but it was difficult to go to sleep because it's just anytime I get off of work I can't go right to sleep so I did end up staying up for a little bit with Nick and then I um I didn't go to sleep until six o'clock and had to be back up at 7 45 to be at my first job at eight. Thankfully, I could pretty much just roll out of bed and get to uh, my, my first job. So that wasn't a problem. Um, now this legitimately is all I did. All I did all day, I, I worked. So on Thursday, literally all that I have is that I worked. 
that was it. <laughs> uh, so on this one, I really am going to try to find something to go down in this full box. But I'm going to go ahead and move on to Friday. Friday, like I told you, went to sleep at 6 and woke up. I, don't, I think I'm going to actually put that on a sticker because... That was crazy. It's a memory planner, and, and although it's semi-insignificant, it's still something that I want to remember, so I'm going to go ahead and put that up here. This is just um, one of, of the stickers for Friday that I did forget. Um, to put down, so. All right. And then after my Bible study, I worked from 8 to 4 30 let my second job know that I wasn't coming in and that was pretty much it for that day uh, I did go to sleep early that was pretty much it so um I actually put it down here. And I loved every moment of it. I had the weekend off, so I went to sleep early, woke up early Saturday, and enjoyed my weekend and then of course i was rejuvenated and back to work my first job on monday so i do have to find something to go there I, i'm pretty sure something else happened okay yeah so before i went to sleep me and nick did go grocery shopping um I'll put that in. And then I do also want to put, I'll probably just put this down here though, or I could put it up there. Maybe. Hmm. Put 
the weekend sticker right there. It's perfect. Thursday when I came home, I had some Happy Mail. Um, so I am going to put that in here as well. And I believe that I have some... Um, dividers that I'll probably put in on the empty spaces. Just so that I don't have a lot of white space because I'm not a really big fan of white space. So. Had Happy Mail from my favorite shop, which is this kit that I'm using. From Gold Paper Prints. That's pretty much it. I'm definitely going to put a divider right there. Um, and I guess I'll fit one in down here. It is going to be a little off just because I'm not going to have a, a lot of foil in here. But my dividers are silver foil. So um, I might move this one up and add one here. I'll make it work. I'm not sure how many I have left, but I will make it work. Saturday, I did, um, oh, I said I got up early, but it looks like I actually slept in on that day. Um, so, let's see, all of those are already taken. All right, so I'm gonna use some headers. So this sticker is probably the only gold paper print sticker I'm not using. And that is um, just because I only have one sleep in for this week. Um, and I'm going to put that on Sunday. But um, it's from Planner Cake. And these are stickers that I bought in one of her uh, buy sell trade groups. So, but that is literally the only gold paper print sticker that I, or the only non gold paper print sticker that I'm using on this week. Everything else is from gold paper prints. 95% of the stickers that I'm using is are from um, the kit itself. Um, I mean, so the kit comes with more than enough. Let me see here. Literally everything here is from the kit except for this one, which I told you came from Planner Kate, and these game controllers. They're still from Gold Paper Prints. The Gold Paper Prints 
I mean, the controllers are from Gold Paper Prints, but they're not from the kit itself. Um, and But First Jesus is not from the kit. And Binge Watch is not from the kit. Upload Video is not from the kit. Um, however, Happy Meal, Plan Laundry, um, The Work Headers, of course, date covers, all of that, all of that is from the kit itself. So now the work labels are an add on. Um, but everything else came. If you get the base kit, or if you get a, okay, if you get the full kit, which is $16.95, um, I mean, you get a lot of stickers. Like I said, everything here except for those little bit that I pointed out are from the kit. I mean, you get more than enough. Um, and if you don't use things, go pick and choose which pages you want and just make your own kit. It, it, all, it will all work for you for sure. So if you're interested, go to Go Paper Prints. Remember, gopaperprints.com. Remember, use my name in the coupon field or code. I think it asks for a code. Uh, just put char25, that's C-H-A-R 25, and you'll get 25% off. And then if you put my name in the description box, you will get my um, scripts freebie. And um, let me show you what that looks like. So you'll get this freebie here, which has budget, but first coffee, birthday, cardio, and anniversary on it. My code is right there in the right-hand corner, chart 25. So if you're interested in anything you see here, remember you can always go to Gold Paper Prints and get it for yourself. Use my code, get the discount, and put my name in the description and get that freebie that I just showed you. So on Saturday, Saturday is my uh, five off of 25 days, which what that means is I go to Dollar General and I shop until I, well, I don't shop until I drop, but I do a five off of 25 deal and it kind of just depends on what I need in the house that week. Uh, sometimes it'll be some snacks, sometimes it'll be some drinks. Um, most, time it, most times it's like, um, you know, household products. So you're gonna have your um, laundry soaps and dish soaps and um, shower gel, shower, yeah, shower gels and uh, pain medicines, things like that. I will do depending on what I have a coupon for. I will do a five off for twenty five deal on Saturday. I film the video, edit it, and upload all in the same day so that others who watch the video can come in pretty much see if it's something that they need and they can check their accounts and see if they have the same coupons and if they do they can run to the store on that day get up to 25 dollars worth of items use your coupons plus you get the five off of 25 it's normally a pretty good deal um so i did do that and of course um I binge watched some Flash because that is my show. Um, yeah, we're gonna change that. Let's see. That's about it for this day. Um, I'm not sure if we watched anything else this day, but we kind of cycled through some shows. Like, we watched all of the Arrow, and then we stopped watching the Arrow, and focused on the flash and then we'll stop watching the flash and watch one episode of supergirl and not too into supergirl so we kind of stopped watching that 
And then the episode called The Crisis came on the flash. So we went and watched the rest of The Crisis uh, because it was, The Crisis was spread through four or five different shows. Uh, so you had The Flash, you had The Arrow, you had Supergirl, um, you had Batwoman, Legends of Tomorrow, um, yeah, I mean, it was like five different, um, it was like five different, um, parts to the crisis so once we watched it on the flash we did go back and watch it on the other just to see how they all went together um i did put these labels down here um for family and i'm just gonna do like right here and do family time <clears throat> Excuse me. And then uh, we ordered a late night snack, which literally was late night because it took forever to come. Uh, personally, hate ordering from DoorDash after dark. Just always seems to be an issue. Um, I need to stop <laughs> ordering from that period, but for sure, late at night. Um, Sunday didn't do anything but watch Nick play the video games. Well, I did a little cleaning as well. Um, but first things first. Um, I did sleep in on this day. Alright, and then I'm going to play So, of course, Sunday is my day off. I'm off Saturday and Sunday. I did some cleaning. And I budgeted for the next week. All right. Let's color that one in. And then towards the evening time, they are going to watch some of the flash. Mm. Let's do one of these little stickers. And I'll just put this one down here. This is just for me personally. Binge watching my YouTube. And I normally really do that right before bed. I'll lay down and I'll watch some YouTube and call it. All right, guys, I know this was a pretty long video, but I did want to share how my week went. So here's the full layout. And um, all these other areas, I'll go back in and do off camera. Um, and I might bring the finished, the entire finished look at the end. But here are pages that I have. So I did 
did use all of the four boxes. Um, I have two glitter headers and this is like the washi strips. Um, or they could be considered like um, like a quarter box and a, and a half box. Um, so that's what this is here. I mean, that's what I have left. Um, on this page, I just have one habit tracker, one three heart checklist. Of course, I have all of the date dots, some icons and some headers left. I have all of the full box, full heart checklist and the Monday one Monday through Sunday box. I have all of my today's to do's little things. Um, I used most of those blank headers or I used all of the blank headers and then I only used one of the little thing, one of the littles. Um, and I used one of the bill do. But um, I think I'm, me personally, I'm gonna start customizing my kits just because I never use these big boxes. I mean, ever. Um, a while back, let me see if I can go back and find the page. Um, Yeah, so the first time I ever used this kit, I did use all of the full boxes. Or not all of them, but I did use, yeah, all of them. I used all of the full boxes. Um, and at that point, I'm looking to figure out, oh my God, what am I going to put in these boxes? And, um, you know, it, it was a little more stressful that way for me personally, trying to fill out the boxes and not leave anything empty. But... Um, I don't I don't want to do that. I want it to be more free where I'm just documenting exactly what happened on that day um, using, you know, half boxes and icons and uh, scripts, things like that, just making it my own. So that's what I did. And guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, please keep coming back. I have been notified by YouTube that a lot of my watchers are not subscribed. So if you're watching my video and you do enjoy what you see, please like, comment, and subscribe. And keep coming back. Remember, guys, be safe. Please wear your mask and be blessed. Bye.